welcome back to a new vlog, a new day. Don't I look so cute? Barely wearing any makeup. And I'm wearing, I'm on my way to church right now. <laughs> Kinda late because <laughs> I was tired, it was raining, I couldn't sleep last night. And I had to wake up mad early just to take care of the dogs. Well, I'm, yeah, the three dogs, not all five, just the three. And I was just, I wasn't feeling it this morning. I was very, very slow. And I was like, you know what? We're going to go to church. We have to go to church. But I'm on my way to the church and did my makeup literally in like 10 minutes. I have eyebrows. I just put concealer on my eyelid, literally concealer right here. I set that, set that with the setting powder. And then I'm wearing the, um, what's that thing called? The liquid blush from Rare Beauty love literally when i tell you was that it's a dot like literally a dot and then i just pat 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 but yeah i'm loving it then i just sprayed it with my peach and lily is that what it's called anyways i sprayed it and now we're on our way to church and i'm really in need of coffee i'm in need of coffee like i really need coffee anyways i will catch up with you guys later i'm probably going to brunch later then i'm probably going to some day party i'm not sure depends on my life today I just, I need to get outside, I need to do something fun, so, yeah. So I got my nails done by myself. I hate short nails, <laughs> but we're trying to save money. So my sister bought me, hey, that was a book. My sister bought this, um, she bought this gel, gel kit on Amazon, and then we had the curing light her friend brought the curing light. It's kind of cute, but I hate short nails because it makes my hand look so stubby. Stubs, I don't like the stubs, but it's, you know, it's giving, it's okay for now, for now thing, until we can save up for, well, I'll get my nails done sometime. When I want to get my nails done, I'll get my nails done. If I want to do something, I'll do it. But I want to save, and I want to budget, and I want to pay off some debt, so therefore, <laughs> we're gonna do our nails until further notice by ourselves, because it's cheaper. Again, I'll see y'all later after church. Yeah. guys it is another day because yesterday was just a lot for me I was very tired after everything I had to do and I did go to brunch well we didn't really go to brunch we didn't go to we went to eat at one of my favorite spots um, restaurant but I love hot pot and whenever I am overwhelmed tired hungry something 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 hot pot is always the place I go to and we went there after church and literally because I didn't eat or do anything in the morning before going to church my head was hurting and after eating where we ate i went back home and i just got really tired and my head was hurting so i just took care of the dogs for 30 minutes and i took a nap or i tried to take a nap i just rested i don't know i'm exhausted my head was hurting even now my head kind of hurts but it's a great morning because you see my skin is shining it's like my skin is shining um and i got up on time got ready on time to care of the dogs i need to take care of and i got ready for work i didn't do my face because i didn't care this morning to do anything to my face well i did mascara but um i made breakfast <laughs> i made breakfast and i got my own coffee because you know you'd be so like I don't know i'd be rushing every morning or i'm usually rushing every morning and usually doing so much that i forget me so this morning 
that's two things or two or three positive things this morning got ready on time made my own coffee didn't have to go buy it and I made my breakfast so it's gonna be a great day I'm gonna continue this positivity um, I already prayed this morning I still need to do my devotional and you know worship so I'm gonna try to do that right now thing I'm still on my way to work but I was doing my devotional just now and I read Psalms chapter 4 verse 6 and 7 I believe and it was saying basically who would who will give us better times if it's not you and it also talked about how God has already given us greater joy than those who have all the riches of everything and that just gave me a lot of comfort this morning because again like I'm trying to find positives in my day and not just focus on like I'm reworking my mind my thinking my way of thinking so I'm trying to find good things and just focus on those things that are good in my life that are good in my day and not just focus on oh my goodness like oh I forgot this in the house oh no the day's ruined no the day's not ruined you're just focusing on that bad part but anyways because it talked about you have already given me greater joy greater joy that means they have joy those who have riches have joy but God is giving you more joy and even if you don't have every single thing that you want and every single thing that you need in that moment, you already have joy. You just have to turn your face to joy. You have to turn around and grab joy. And I don't know, I just thought I wanted to, I, I couldn't encourage you guys with that word this morning. Um, it's Psalms 6, no, Psalms 4, verse 6 and 7. If you want to read it, I'll put it, put it right here. But um, yeah, just have a great day, y'all. Whenever you see this, just let it resonate with you. I pray you do see joy in every aspect of your life and you feel love and you feel overwhelming love and joy peace grace oh god that sun wow and the light of the lord <laughs> like the sun on my face oh and by the way y'all when you're driving try to wear polarized sunglasses to protect your eyes and also wear sunscreen on your hand because your hand is being What's the word I'm looking for? This is my polarized sunglasses that I got from Amazon. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of buying like $100 glasses from my eye doctor. Anyways. But yeah. Sunscreen. I have my sunscreen in my car. This is the black girl sunscreen. And I always put it on my hands when I'm driving because protect the hands so you don't have old people in hands. Hands. At 20 whatever age I am. Anyways. Yeah guys later so I'm at work it's 10 what time is it it's 10 38 today on Monday on a Monday and our power keeps going out for the past 20 minutes now the power keeps going out in the whole building so um guess who's about to go <laughs> I haven't even done anything for work like I've been trying to do work but these people here, hmm? they try to, well, they don't all like to handle the technical stuff at work. So they make me do it. Anyways, I've been trying to like literally fix printer problems since 8 a.m. that I got here. <sighs> I love my job so much. <sighs> Anyways, but yeah, power keeps going out. If it's literally, the consensus is if it doesn't get fixed within the next 15, 20 minutes, you might as well go work from home because what's the point? And it's so windy today. It's so windy. And we're thinking it might be the wind. But I don't know if it's like power lines or if it's just a circuit breaker because this building is very old. Why am I talking to you about this? I should be going home. I want to go home. Yeah. Great day. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. It's like I really hope I get to go home so I can just go do what I need to do. I work, but I need it's better at home. Lord, please. Literally have to get a flashlight. I'm still at work. Power is still out. It's been an hour. And they want me to wait till like around lunchtime. It's 11 right now, but it's been happening since 10. So you want me to waste my time when I could have been home. 30 minutes ago if we had left and then I could have been working so it's like productivity is down which sense 
Makes sense. Going to my chiropractor's office because I got a kink in my neck. It's like, <laughs> my neck really hurts and it's giving me a bad headache, like a migraine. I, I used to suffer from migraines, I'm gonna say in Jesus' name. I used to suffer from migraines, but when it comes like that, it's more ocular, but then I also feel it in the back of my head and my occipital portion of my brain. And that means the back, the base of the neck. Yeah, um, it hurts, so I'm about to go. About to hop in the car, I'm always on the move, yeah. But I'm gonna go to the chiropractor, then I have to come back home. I'm probably not going to the gym today. I'm tired, I don't feel good. Hey guys, so I'm literally vlogging. <laughs> I had to put a light up because I wanted to see my face and vlog at the same time. But I legit had to get ready in 10 minutes because a lot has happened. I didn't even put highlight on. I just, yeah, I'm tired. My head still hurts, actually. I'm about to go out to dinner with one of my friends. And I don't know. I don't know if it's just me, but. Just trying to say good night. It's been a good day. Wow, I rushed through this makeup. <laughs> Whatever, that's cool. And I've also I didn't set anything. I literally just did it and left. And two ways. It's been a long day, an interesting day. It's still a good day, but just wanted to check in, wrap up with you guys. Um. Oh, this is my skincare cream. I don't know why it's right here, but it's right here. Um, yeah, so I'm grateful that it was a good day, but I'm about to wipe off my makeup, pray, read my Bible. I've been doing a Psalms devotional um, every night and sometimes in the morning. It just helps me reset my mind and to stay in a attitude of gratitude grat I don't how do you say that to stay grateful look at that um yeah and to just keep my mind at peace before I go to bed but yeah I'll see you guys in the morning god bless you please don't judge my face because I'm tired and I need to wipe off my makeup it looks tired right now because I didn't even I think I came home and I've just been laying on here for like the past hour I've just been laying on my bed and it's crazy oh my god let me talk about that real quick it's weird that I came home and I didn't have to cook or really like do a lot I got the dogs to eat and go pee and poop and all that came to my room just put this on because I just wanted like loose clothing on and I just laid here for the past 30 minutes. And I was like, don't I have to do so much? And I'm like, no, I don't. That's so weird for me. But again, grateful. So I'm just going to wipe this off. And good night. Love you. Buenos dias. Good morning. Good morning. Ooh, not my voice. Still not, still not awake. Hello, can I please turn? Can I please? Hello? Thank you, God bless you. I think I've been here before. Hi guys, good morning. <laughs> that was just... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Good morning. Um, having an interesting morning, I guess. I have to go to the dermatologist's office, so I'm not at work right now. It's like currently 9.02 two minutes late because it's raining and people don't know how to drive i gave myself enough time to get here to even like have rest time 
and waiting. Okay, I'll go since you don't want to go. Nobody knows how to drive. Anyways, I'm at the dermatologist's office. I am about to pull in the park right now and then I'm gonna go upstairs. Hopefully I like this dermatologist. I was really looking for a black one, but I don't know if I got a black one. I think I got a, oh, I think she's Indian. I literally made this appointment like two months ago. So we'll see how this goes. Praying it's a good one. Praying she can help me with what I'm dealing with. I'm really here to make sure I'm up to par with, up to par? Make sure I'm doing the right things for my skin and making sure that, well, I'm also here for alopecia. I'm dealing with alopecia, but I think it's stress induced. So it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. We're gonna get to the bottom of it and it's gonna be healed in Jesus name because my hair gotta grow. My hair, maybe we'll talk about it some other time, but I've had an interesting journey with my hair and I'm trying to grow it and it just feels like every time I try to grow my hair, something, something, very much something happens. So yeah, I'm gonna talk to y'all later. I'm about to go in here. Bye. I, I am annoyed, pissed, annoyed, annoyed, pissed, annoyed. It's not a black dermatologist or an Indian dermatologist like I thought. It's a white woman, which, you know, you know what you're doing here, doctor. My lady just told me I can't wear braids. I can't, I can't wear braids. <laughs> oh my gosh right now I'm sitting in my car just left the appointment and I'm really thinking should I get a new dermatologist honestly when doctor doctor miss lady was talking the entire time she was speaking after she said you can't wear plaits or twists or braids because they're tugging on your hair and they're too heavy for your scalp. And I said, which kind of heavy, hmm? This actually doesn't feel heavy for me at all. It literally feels like there's nothing on my head. But she said, yeah, but for your scalp, which could be true, but it's just annoying to me now. So I'm gonna sound like this. For your scalp, it seems as though it's too heavy and it's, your scalp cannot take that. And I said, what? <laughs> I didn't know what else to say and then she was like waiting for me to talk and I'm just like there's no way I can't ask you questions because what are you what suggestions are you gonna give me to leave my hair out like you no babe it don't work like that my hair don't work like that and I said well I can't straighten it she's like yeah I was like I can't do anything because it's gonna break it yeah and I'm like what am I gonna do anyways I waited for her to leave and then her tech who is it um she's Hispanic I believe let me not say Hispanic because I don't want to be want to be pc about this but she was like yeah honestly girl just do jumbo braids i was like so i was like, i can't even pull my hair back for a ponytail she's like no especially not i said what about wigs i gotta do uh because <laughs> i'm like what else am i gonna do i gotta do braids under that she was like heck no do not do no do not do no old cornrows at all i was like no cornrows the way in my head i was like i had a whole plan to do a music video with cornrows and a different hairstyle now that's dead I don't like this. I don't like this at all. But yeah, I'm so confused because um, I'm black. I'm black. I'm African. This is what we do. Um, I don't know what to do. I'm not going to put heat in my hair. Ah! What am I gonna do? And then after that, I thought I lost my car. <laughs> I thought someone broke into my car and stole my car because this place is huge and I came out on the wrong side apparently and they look similar. And I'm over here looking like crazy for like 10 minutes looking for my car like, where's my car? I almost called the cops. Legit, I almost called the cops. I was like, you know what, maybe it's on the other side. Maybe we came out on a different side. I'm very dramatic. But this is my life. Apparently the little tiny twist that I'm doing that literally feels like nothing on my, I do my own hair. And again, I was telling you guys, I don't grip my hair Oh, purposely for that for that reason i don't want to hurt my scalp i don't grip it too hard and that's why i'm always doing something different to my hair i don't keep the same hairstyle because it ends up looking like old after like a week and a half or something 
Ya. Yeah. Hey guys, it's the way I'm in Target. I came to Target for one thing. You never come to Target for one thing. Target will tell you what you need. You know, I used to be a Walmart babe. Hmm? A Walmart babe where I know I will not spend that much money. And then over the pandemic, I decided let's switch it up. Um, yeah, so now I'm looking at Honest Beauty and I'm looking at some lip glosses that I need from the NYX Butter Lip Gloss. I'm looking at that right now. Ew. I don't need it, but it says 20% with Target Circle. I'm gonna get it. I miss getting the soft matte. My nails are not done, but it's fine. The soft matte lip um, lip cream from them. And then I just, I, I literally just finished one of my um, lip gloss from NYX Butter Gloss. So it's not in the budget, but I'm stressed. It's been a week and I needed some type of retail therapy. So I'm giving it to myself just a bit, but I'm gonna get this Honest um, Lip Balm because they're vegan but oh, I love skincare I love makeup I love just walking through Target technically right now I'm on a date I'm on a date for myself it's like but this weekend I think I'm trying to actually take myself out get dressed be cute do makeup change my hair which I'm gonna do today take out my hair and do some type of something to my hair Remember, I'm not supposed to pull my hair up or do braids or plaits or twist. Anyways, I'll figure it out. I'll figure out what to do. But I think I'm just going to put a wig on. But yeah, I'm just in here in Target trying to pick up some stuff that I, I literally came for one thing and one thing only. But I love makeup. I really love makeup. If this channel ends up being a makeup thing. Yeah. Okay, found what I needed. Found what I needed. Um, I was supposed to just go to Target and buy one thing and it was supposed to just be like I don't know less than ten dollars let's just say I'm not buying food out <laughs> I literally just spent it's not that bad it's not that bad I spent like forty dollars yeah anyways um i need to fix my shirt and i also got starbucks if you know me you know i love me some starbucks okay bye y'all thank you guys so much for watching this vlog if you have any suggestions recommendations thoughts on anything that i talked about in this vlog let me know drop it down in the comments if you have any recommendations for a dermatologist let me know drop it down in the comments let me know your thoughts let me know how you're feeling um yeah i'll see you all in the next vlog have a great day week everything bye